Yo, yo, all my game musicians out there, this is Even Not Just Elbow. Double O, short for short, and welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Ken Lara, and we're back here at the road called, just simply called Destiny, and I have my Infernape already out to do some more grinding while being on Victory Road, which I'm guessing is going to be packed with thousands of, maybe millions and billions of trainers, so let's just see. But first of all, we have to go through all the badge checking. So, wait, what? What? How did Team Rocket get here? Do I really have to battle these guys on the way to Victory Road here? What's going on? It's you, just as predicted. Cynthia knew you would come after her, so she ordered some grunts to guard this... Let me guess, I have to defeat all eight of you to confirm my badges. I'm guessing that is how this is all going to be set up here. And, well, speak of the devil, I have the perfect Pokemon out for this. Oh boy, here we go. Grovile, you excuse me, Sceptile, you will receive the fiery blast of of your lifetime while I give Houndoom a very quick and swift bath. And I know quick and swift are both synonymous, sue me. And even if Sceptile is only very low on health there, Sceptile was gonna go down from Surf anyway, so. Yeah. And Houndoom will live to see another day, unfortunately. However, that bath must have really done wonders. Now I'm gonna give it the spa treatment. Or maybe not. Okay, so... Yeah, I don't want to use... I don't want to use a recoil move on you, so I'm gonna use Thunder Punch instead. And I'll just use the Surf. Even though Thunder Punch should probably finish it off. Yep, yeah, it did. And luckily, I got a critical hit to boot. Get out of here. I guess it doesn't matter. Nope. Because you go down for the count. Now, will you please confirm my first badge? I get the feeling you are far too strong to be stopped by mere grunts now. Primarily because this game had to force me to grind up my Pokemon and um, become far stronger than you guys. And... You know, whether that makes me strong or not, your Pokemon are still at around level 86, so what are you talking about, man? We scared the police officers away. Yeah, I I can see that. Team Rocket is taking over Kenlara. Or rather, I think you guys are just about to lose the whole ground here since I, since, you know, that last setback at Sea Sworn Tower, where I battled the brainwashed gym leader just to get the 8th badge to visit you guys. So I think there ha there has to be... There has to be some sort of... Has to be some sort of red... You know, some sort of rebound here. There has to be some kind of... You know... Huge setback for you guys. What? Okay, good. Thank you. Unfortunately, I have to endure a rock slide here. Unfortunately, Infernape might have to get a bath here. Or maybe not. Hopefully not. Yeah, luckily, Infernape is only affected by Earthquake and other moves like like Earthquake. But you know, again... You guys experienced just a huge setback back at that tower. You would think that you guys would be very very tired by now, you know, that you may may just, you know, consider giving up and maybe disbanding once again, or, you know, just disbanding your your Kenlara branch. But I guess not. I guess you guys are remaining strong. Primarily because Cynthia is still, is still active. I think that may be the reason why. Why did I even bother trying to stop you? I have no idea why. Maybe it's because you're just a hack. You're just a grunt of a hack. At this point, you just wipe us so fast, I don't even know where the toilet paper is. What's even the point when you just wipe our ass on us? Okay, quarter note. Tremolo. Swartzando. And what we have here is a Glissando. As we speak, Cynthia is fighting the Elite Four. If she wins, which I bet you anything she will, can Lara's ours unless I stop her. Because that's how it usually rolls out in any kind of Pokemon re region. I defeat the champion, and the game progresses. 
That's how we get the credits, folks. That's how we get the credits, is by defeating the champion. Because the game is forcing us to become the champion, because it just doesn't want it... It just doesn't want it any other way. So let's have a pathetic rock... Let's land a pathetic rock smash on a bear. And you... Bastard, you cheap bastard. Oh, you cheap bastard. Kangaskhan, you son of a kangaroo. You, you jackaroo jagoff. Oh my god. That that was stupid. That was stupid for you to pull off that endure there. Clever, but stupid. Oh my god. God, you clever bastard. It's thrashing about! And I, di I somehow die by that! Oh my god, what was that? Okay, Tyrantar. And while, while I have my Tyrantar out, I will be... Well, Kangaskhan goes down anyway, because you know, so that Endure was a, probably a tad pointless there. I don't know why he strategically just pulled up an Endure when my Tyrantar was going to be coming out anyway. Even though he didn't really see it coming, since I didn't think I didn't expect my Infernape to fall right away. <sighs> I can't believe I have to I, I can't believe I have to waste a revive on a rocket grunt. This is sad. Do I have any more revives? Yeah, I have one one left. I better use it well. I should have, you know, stocked up a lot more when I was back at Sunside City, but whatever. You go down. Get out of here. Get out of my sight. My trap here is done. Yep. All we have to do is buy time for Cynthia. I mean, that's what you're doing right now. It's just you're essentially stalling for time. While Cynthia just pulls off her plan of successfully defeating the Elite Four because the Elite Four sucks. Or, you know, judging by the fact that they probably all are in the level 100 range, which I will have to probably do after I get through Victory Road, if there is a Victory Road for that matter. I will probably have to troll grind again, and you know, just get all my Pokemon up to either level 100 or just make do with maybe going at least at level 98, and probably stocking up heavily on X attacks. Uh, X attacks and at, at speeds and probably just anything more in between and just treat it like a competitive battle Because that's what it's gonna be. It's that's probably what's gonna come down to at that point. It's just being a very competitive style Pokemon battle and Do we have an inescapable battle here? Yep Cynthia needs more time feel free to take your time with me because I I am forced to battle you since you know all the other obstructions for me to try to battle you first. Fortress and Bronzong, hello. Well, I'm gonna be taking care of Bronzong right away. Or actually, actually, no, no, never mind. So, here's what I'm gonna do. Fire Blast you, and then I'll try to Rock Smash you just in case if Infernape's Fire Blast fails, which it didn't, which was good. And that should be, that should bring it down one hit because, you know, it being bug steel. So there we go. Fortress goes down, Fortress goes down. And unfortunately, Bronzong is also a psychic type, so it won't go down with just one little rock smash. However, <clears throat> I can try Fire Blast again and hope to come out on top. And I will use, uh... Ice Beam, I guess. Yeah, there we go. You go down, Bronzong. Bang a gong, get it on. Bang a gong. Tit Willow, Tit Willow, Tit Willow. Now I haven't accessed Zillow in a long time, so I need to, you know, access Zillow with my pillow. Oh, oh, okay, not bad, yep. Oh, 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 Henry! Any minute of time, we can buy... Any minute... Well, I don't know why I said it like that. Any minute of time, we can buy Cynthia as valuable. You'll never make it in time! Which, yeah, I think that will be inevitable. Because I never make it in time. I mean, think of the... Uh, think of all the other generations. You know, I didn't really make it in time before... Gary slash Blue made it to... To the championships. I didn't make it to... Um, Cynthia's launching multiple operations across the land. 
Once she is the league champion, the police and local defenses of the region will be under her control. Oh no! Whatever shall we do? Will the entire Elite Four be brainwashed? We won't find out until the next episode. But anyway, as I was saying before, I didn't make it in time before Lance showed up. I didn't make it in time before Steven showed up. I didn't make it in time before Cynthia showed up. The other Cynthia. So yeah, I mean, we can go all the way down the line and it still doesn't really matter. I mean, I didn't make it in time before N showed up. Uh, let's see. I will be using Thunder Punch on you since you're a water type. And, uh... Might as well. I might as well use Surf because you're a ground type. And unfortunately, Masquerade sadly doesn't go down in one hit. However, Pile of Swine may definitely not go down in one hit because of its bulky defense. Yeah, Pile of Swine is pretty bulky. It's a pretty bulky Pokemon. It's thrashing about! Hopefully, I don't succumb to this thrash. Thank you. Not this time. Compared to Houndoom's Thrash. My, or actually, compared to Ursaring's Thrash, because oh my god, that was bad. I would. I could use a Fire Blast, but instead I'm gonna be using a close combat move. Because why the heck not? I would rather. I would rather conserve my PP than just. You know, waste all my Fire Blasts and have to go all the way back to Sunset City to heal up. Because I don't have any elixirs on me. Ah ha ha ha! Achoo! Just had to Im imitate that hiker from, you know, that obligatory hiker from on the way to Lavender Town. He can beat us grunts up, but we are just pawns in Cynthia's master 4D chess plan. <sighs> Everything is a chess plan. My life is a chess plan. My life is like a chess game. You just never know when I am going to be killed by bishops. Or just basically stomped on by rooks. Darn those rooks. Yay, more rooks! Okay. Or rather, yay, more pawns! And the word of the day is, or rather, the phrase of the day is, buy more pawns! Buy more pawns for your chess game to make the game even more, even more cheap. You're already here, and I must stop you, because, yeah must, you know, take everything into full consideration that I am a trainer and that I must make it, I, I must be stopped before, hello Carnivine, I must be stopped before, before I actually foil Cynthia's very master, master plan. I don't know why I said, ma I, actually I don't know why I used electric. I paralyzed it, but yeah, I should probably just use a fire blessed anyway because I will have to heal up, I will have to heal up anyway. Given that we're probably not going to have any nurses along the way, so I might as well use this time right now to. I need a. No! What I need to probably do is I probably might have to. I probably might have to waste one of my PPs, one of my PP ups, assuming that we have trainers in here. And it looks almost the same as the Kanto Victory Road. Oh my god, did you really steal this whole thing? Did you really rip off the entire Victory Road here? But anyway, again, assuming that we have trainers in here, even though Victory Road doesn't have to have any trainers, given that Johto didn't have any trainers at all, except for Silver, um... I'm gonna assume that we may have trainers along the way. And how many po how many Oh Rhydon, hello! How many very strong Pokemon are we gonna be encountering in here? Well we have Rhydon for one. Anything else you wanna throw at me, game? Steal it! Okay, so I guess I won't have to use an I won't have to use a metal code after all, yay. Or rather an upgrade. I think I have to... It's either with Metal Coat or Upgrade. I can't remember which item that to have the Onyx hold and... Or, you know, that the, um... I have to make sure that the person I'm trading with holds a Metal Coat, um, for Onyx in order to... 
to s successfully make my Onyx evolve into Steelix. And now yeah, I guess we don't have any trainers at all. Wow. Well, I guess that was all, all for naught. I guess I didn't have to go all the way back to Sunside. That was a pretty generous game. Thank you. However, hello, Hariyama. However, will we make, will we run into any trainers in the next level? I guess we'll find out. Yeah, no strength puzzles. Come on, you have to be a lot better than that. You have to at least give me some kind of a challenge. You have to be a lot better than that god game. After all the after all the curveballs you throw at me, you have to give me a you have to give me a curve here. After all the curveballs that you just basically threw at me, all the challenging curveballs and the ridiculous hello, um, Conkouder or Conkouder. Um, after all the ridiculous. Um, curve balls that you just keep throwing at me here with the challenges, ch challenges and whatnot. You would think that you would, you know, at least give me some kind of a challenge in here because that is what Victory Road is notorious for. Okay, but anyway, we have Professor Oak here for, for some odd reason, or rather, um, Professor Toke. Woke speaks for the distorted. Oh, you gotta be kidding me! Are you? Don't tell me you're brainwashed too, and I have to battle you. I am here on command by Cynthia. I will not let you pass. Great! Now I have to battle the likes of you again! Okay, Venusaur! What a way to start off my Fire Blast if I pull it off. What chances are I probably might not. Or maybe I will! Well, five successfully accurate Fire Blasts. Who would have thunk it? Not I. Holy moly, Jack Adoles, I didn't really think that I would defeat his Venusaur so easily. Right on, however, will be something of a different matter, so let me go back to Furret. And let me just take care of Right on that way. Maybe. Yeah, I mean, considering that Right on has very slow speed. I should be able to finish it off in one or at least maybe one and a half try. Yep, one and a half. Because it really couldn't be that easy. Because again, of all the curveballs. And again, with all the curveballs that they throw at me here. Oh my god. Okay, fine. I will just deal with. I'll deal with you my own way. Here. Here. Pathetic Dark Pulse. I should have known, I should have known that a brainwashed gym leader would have a, would still have a healing move. And be very annoying. Okay, so anyway, or anyway, Earthquake. Why the hell not? Get out of here, right on, please. I shouldn't have to deal with you another turn at... <sighs> you jerk store. Oh my god, you jerk store. And yeah, boy, that stone edge really packs quite a punch. Holy moly. Please get out of here. I do not stand to see you ever again, except, you know, when I'm trying to struggle my way through Victory Road. Hello, Kazam. I will be keeping out Tyranitar for this one. <laughs> Unfortunately, actually, well... Given that the AI can be kind of questionable here, it's just, you know, it's a lot like Gen 7 AI. It's probably going to give me something a lot... Yeah, like an energy ball. Of course, something like that would be bound to happen. <sighs> Again, the AI here is very... <laughs> is absolutely, absolutely infamous. Luckily, though, Alakazam still has very shitty defense, so you... You... You fuck off. Fuck off! Okay, so back to you, Infernape, we go... Oh, yes. For a second there, I thought I was going to be checking the summary, accidentally, of my Tyranitar. Of my... Of my fifth to sixth chair. I can't remember which ranking he's in. All I do know... All I do know is... That my Infernape is still my first chair concertmaster, so... And he is going to be pulling off the cadenza of a lifetime here. Cadence or Cadet? I can't remember. I think it's Cadence. You know, the solo that, you know, violins and cellos can play in a violin or 
cello concerto or or a piano concerto for that matter and yeah that was very bad let's hope for the best that we finish up last toys in the next turn i'm hoping hopefully i don't succumb to sandstorm which i didn't thank god thank gengar you go down please Yay for Charizard. Who can I use to counter him? I guess I have no other choice but to bring out my Tyranitar, because, yeah, fire flying. However, I bet you anything, again, given the, given the AI, he may have a trick up his sleeve. I will have to just anticipate that. And just make me wait. It's keeping me waiting. And where are the... Where are the Hyper Potions? There we are. There are the blessed Hyper Potions. Where's the rum? Where's the beef? Yeah, let me just see here. Okay, luckily he's just pumping up his attack power, which I'll just take. And unfortunately, I probably won't outspeed Charizard here, so... We'll just have to anticipate the next move that he's going to be pulling off here. Hopefully, again, it's... Hopefully it's not egregious. Nope, it's just Dragon Claw. Okay, sure. But Rock Slide, though, should do the trick. Maybe. Just... Maybe, yes. Excellent. What a good way to pull it off, Tyranitar. I'm proud of you, buddy. And that's it. You get out of here. You better snap out of it, or else I'm not gonna be... You know, saying hi to you ever again, and, and you just vanish, of course, Team Rocket style. Yay, more Victory Road! And, you know, I what I probably should do here... Okay, who's here? Torkoal, hello! I never thought I'd be seeing you here. But I think right now what I should probably do is I will probably have to use a Max Thingy. And I will have to heal up my Pokemon, so see you then. And we're back here on the second floor of Victory Road. And looks like we have an item here and a meteor. You know, looks like a meteor struck. And what was that? Was that Roar? Not that I want to learn Roar anyway. No, it's Calm Mind. That's, that's a pretty good move. And it looks like that I might be able to buy Calm Mind in certain shops, like in the de department store, I don't know. But anyway, um, I guess we do have a trainer here after all. That is, if she is a trainer. Oh, okay, so Elise. So I guess we're going through the gauntlet of the gym leaders again. Elise speaks with a distorted voice. You cannot go any further, summoner. Great, so we're... That's actually kind of... Kind of nifty. That even though we may not... You escaped from the Aroma Lady Battle Sprite. I forgot about you. But anyway... I like how, even though we don't have any trainers specifically, you know, any regular average Joe trainers to face in, in Victory Road here, at least we may have an interesting gimmick here going on around with them. So maybe, um... Just, um... A certain gauntlet with facing the gym leaders again. That, that actually... That's actually pretty... Pretty clever there. It's pretty ingenious. I never thought I would be doing that in, if I was making a game. So anyway, Ludicolo with your Sombrero of Death. Why does a level 89 Ludicolo still have a primer move? You would think that you have better moves than that. You would think that you would have better moves than Protect and Detect. Oh, Come on, you are a gym leader. You should be a lot better than that. You should be a lot more strategic than that. Okay, well, Vespercoin, you go. You come on out. You come on out, my friend. Oh no, Scald. <laughs> It's a good thing that I survived Scald in any way because I'm a because I'm not a fire type because I switched my fire type out. So ha! 
Take that! Now uh, you're a douchebag, but Leech Seed is not going to affect me anyway, since, again, Vesper Quen is a bug type, and Grass doesn't really... Grass isn't really all that revolting against bugs anyway. You jerk store! Stop using protect for the... Christ's sakes, man. Or rather, woman. Luckily, I stocked up on a lot more full heals, but I might die... Oh. Stupid protect! Oh my god, that was sad. That was absolutely sad. What was that? Okay, okay, let me revive. It's a good thing I stocked up more on revives, too. Oh my god, I can't believe I have to waste a revive here already because of, you know, because of tomfoolery. <sighs> For Christ's sakes. I mean, I'll quit pro quo. That's how Leech Seed always plays out. Let's go back to Vespa Quinn. Yay for Scald again. Hopefully I don't get burned again. Thank you. And you better not use Protect, actually, before I do anything else. Let me right now, before I regret it again, let me right now bring out a Hyper Potion and heal my Vespa Quinn up right away. So then, you know, heads won't roll. Good. It's a close one. Okay, we get it. We get it. You have leftovers. We get it. You also have a primer move like Leech Seed, which doesn't really do anything for a bug. I mean, it may have equal, you know, drainage power, but. <laughs> Even then, though, my Vesper Quen is still going to come out on top, regardless of whether, what other move that you're going to be bringing out. But from what it looks like, you're... <laughs> you douchebag! Stop using Protect for the love of Gengar! And everything here under the sun of Gengar, I implore you to stop with that. Holy moly, will you please just, you know, die, please? Of course not, because this game had to be very unkind. Christ's sakes. This is really wasting a- this is- All that is being right now, all that Ludico- All that Ludicolo is being right now is being a time waster. Thing is, really, I could have, I should have finished off Ludicolo first turn, but no, I have to kind of endure a sandstorm, endure leech seed, endure leftovers, which is just being a pain in the neck, and I have to use another fucking re five. Oh my god, I can't believe it! I just can't believe it! This is so totally unnecessary here. I can't believe I have to, you know, wait this... I, I can't believe I'm wasting five minutes on trying to defeat Ludicolo out of... Oh my god, it shouldn't be that hard to beat the hell out of Ludicolo here. It really shouldn't be. Oh my god, he's just making it very hard for me. Just making it harder than... Than how it normally is seriously he's making it a lot more complicated than what it should be here I should have finished off with a colo why I had Vesper Quinn out but no he had to use a primer move like fucking protect seriously this is ridiculous this is absolutely ludicrous oh hey here actually Ice Beam, you do something. Oh my god. And that was a critical hit! Ugh. This is ridiculous! Come on, brother! Throw me a bone! Throw me a dry bones here! My god! 
Home, holy moly, shitteroni here! Okay, fine, let me bring up Vesper Coin again because this Ludicolo is just absolutely tenacious. Ah, oh, why is he so tenacious? Why couldn't have I just finish him off the third turn? It really shouldn't have been that hard to beat the hell out of the sombrero Daffy Duck. Thank you for evading the attack this time. That could have just turned out far more, far more Byzantine. Now please don't miss fly this time. We get it! You have leftovers! Can I please just finish you off? So then we can move on! Of course not, because this game is a... This game is a fucking mother! It really is a fucking motherfucker! Why can't I just finish him off? Why can't I just finish a stupid Donald Duck off? Just a grass, you know, just a salsa dancing, grassy sombrero we 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 wearing Donald Duck off. Uh, Donald D -D 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 Duck off. Seriously. And I shouldn't be saying Donald Dunk. I should be saying Donald Duck. Stop fucking using protect! I just want to finish you fucking off! Please! Oh, please! You're turning me into a madman here! You're seriously turning me into a straitjacket man mad! I'm a madman! Stop! How many protects do you have? How many protects do you have? Can I please just finish you off? Let me just try attack order. Will that do anything? Stop using protect! Stop using fucking protect! Let me just finish you off, please! I just want to move on to the third Pokemon here. Please, game, throw me a bone! I'll wait. I'll wait until you get done here. How long has this battle been going on here? Thank you. Holy moly. That was... This was stupid. This is a stupid battle. I really don't know what else to say except that it really was a very... It, it is a stupid battle because the battle was not even done yet. Oh boy, Giga Drain. Yeah, do your worst. I'm a bug type. However, I have the upper hand. You should go down in the next turn. If you if you survive this hit and if you use a hyper potion, I will be screaming like a monkey. Go! I'm very glad you are down. Oive! Oh my god, that shouldn't have taken that long to finish you off. Oh, for the love of god. Okay, now fly! You better you better work this time, Best Coin. You better. You better pull off fly this time. You better be you be, 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 better pull off a fly. You better pull off. You better. Sus of course not, because this game has stupid AI and it's making me just absolutely, absolutely stas stas stammer because of it. Good, I'm glad you missed Thunder Punch. Oh my god. Please go down. Oh, please go down. Thank you. That could have been a lot. That could have been a lot more challenging. Breloom, I will be keeping you out. I mean, I could be, you know, using for it for more experience, but. Vespa. Vespa Quen needs to catch up with her own experience. So I think right now, what I think I really need to do is just, number one, relax so then I can stop stuttering. Number two, you know, just, just, you know, talk in fragments so then I will let everyone know that I do stutter. 
Number three, I will be just waiting this out until I can finally just, you know, sweep, swoop down and finish this out. What? Why would you, why would you fucking have Stone Edge? Why? Why? Seriously, why is the AI so stupid? Why is it so dumb? Why do they have... Why exactly does this game have trainers that just have tricks all the way up their sneezy noses? My god. This is my third revive. I shouldn't have to waste a revive on either one of you. Especially because they fucking breathe them, which should be taken down in one hit. Oh my god, this is so stupid. This is really stupid. This is so fucking stupid, man. Why is it just train out like this? Oh my god, please just go down. Thank you for freezing up. Oh my god. Oh my fucking god. It's a good thing you're still... Uh, actually, did you... Did the game thaw it out? Did it just seriously thaw it out here? This game... This game is gonna be the end of me now. I liked this game before, but now I absolutely hate it! I hate it! I seriously hate it. It's probably now worse than Pokemon Resolute. I, I now hate it. I'm sorry guys, but I, I hate this game now. I seriously hate this... I hate this game. With all my might. It's really making me super angry here. And it really shouldn't because I'm right now facing a lease with with somewhat overleveled Pokemon. And it's just not really doing me any favors. It's just not it's waiting out this entire battle for me. Now, not that I don't mind a challenge, but it shouldn't be unnecessary. You know, it should you know it should Give me a sporting chance here of trying to finish off the trainer. It could at least do me that. It could at least, you know, offer me that. Oh, I, I, I'm done with this after I'm done here. I'm after I'm done here. I'm, I'm stopping the game right here after I'm done. This really, this seriously shouldn't be that. You, wh how is you? How exactly do you have superpower? And why, why did my superpower miss? WHAT THE FUCK IS THIS BATTLE?! WHAT THE FUCKING FUCK IS THIS BATTLE?! I DON'T BELIEVE THIS! I JUST DON'T FUCKING BELIEVE THIS! I DON'T BELIEVE WHAT IS HAPPENING HERE! I JUST SERIOUSLY DON'T BELIEVE WHAT IS HAPPENING! DESTINY MY ASS! YOU ARE JUST BASICALLY... YOU'RE BASICALLY SLASHING... ALL... ALL HOPES AND DREAMS OF DESTINY THAT I HAD! You go down, Cacturn. I can't believe I have to use my Concert Master for this. I can't believe I have to use my first chair to mop the floor here. Oh my god! Okay, so guess what? There. I hope you're happy.